Hello viewers and welcome to this new video. Today we are in Battle of Warships again and we are gonna sail in the Japanese aircraft carrier or I mean light aircraft carrier IJN Junio. Some of you asked for this ship to play and I literally had this gameplay today so I'm gonna put this on YouTube and so without further ado let's start viewing the specification of the ship. We have a pretty low HP for an aircraft carrier compared to other ones but for uh, this tier is enough. We have a low speed compared to other aircraft carrier this is the second slowest and it's very very much slower than the others that reach more than 40 knots, 45 around. Instead we have one of the best maneuverability in all the game, I should say, because uh, for the aircraft carrier it's for sure the most maneuverable and this allows to dodge bombs and torpedoes and make very good maneuvers in close quarters also. We have 30 aircraft which are 6 groups and are not very very good compared to other ships, other aircraft carriers, I mean. These are pretty low, but instead of the Sangamon that has an uh, even lower number, this is enough if used correctly. We have no main armament of course, we have these and AA guns, not the best, but are enough. Torpedoes not, but we have aircraft, the first type it's good, but we're gonna use the second type, which has good damage for torpedoes and bombs. And yeah, the planes are good. So this is one positive thing of the ship, is the plane are good. For the customization I chose the Russian flag. I don't know why, maybe once they added into the game the ship uh, I chose this because of the maneuverability. I should have put the Brazilian flag, but I already did the gameplay, so we are using uh, the Russian flag. I chose the Oscar flag, the black camouflage, and the German Imperial Navy sticker. I said I already did this gameplay, and so this is gonna be not an easy gameplay but a tactical one because uh, we are gonna have some bad luck but also good luck for ourselves and bad luck for the team but this is gonna be a cool gameplay so watch it and have fun so without further ado let's take this light aircraft carrier to battle okay we have <laughs> Damn, three aircraft carriers per team. Uh, yeah, fortunately on the enemy team there are royal sovereigns that even though they are not extraordinarily powerful they can hit me hard. Anyways, we have a Dunkirk in our team that seems good. Seems, but... Starting with the fact that she don't even have a camouflage means that she is not extraordinary. Another thing is that this uh, CV is not secondaries, if I remember right. And so we cannot push very hard. I wanna. Um, get some planes uh, before uh, starting uh, the attacks. Also, a problem is that we do not have uh, lots of planes, so that is gonna be a problem. Uh, if we end up finishing our planes And so, you know, even though we are not gonna hit 
these ripples. We have uh, to watch very good our planes and don't lose them. So. Why are these torpedoes for me? I don't think that. Uh, some of my planes are going inside the AA guns. Oh, we almost lost one. Oh, come on, this uh, this ship is turning so hardly everywhere. She did die, we have zero damage. gonna push we hope I think where is the best way to go right now here who is there a Julio right there we have a royal sovereign fighting against a grocer go first and the royal sovereign is having the, the best My torpedoes are not gonna hit ever. And these torpedoes are gonna hit me instead. Nope. I'm not good at CVs, you know. I'm not doing that literally anything. Uh, we have to hit this Royal Sovereign. I hope that this is right. There are uh, lots of CVs right there. There's that Royal Sovereign. Which is not looking at me. For some weird reason. We did hit a Torpedoes. On her, but we didn't even set a float. I hope this is right. This ship is neither even fast, but it's extraordinarily maneuverable. Look at that. This super maneuver. Oh, I think that Royal Sovereign died. No, these planes, no, please. Oh, they are a mistake. We might be able to destroy every plane in this battle, uh, but I don't think if that we can do that. You know, destroying every plane is a hard task, even for an AA ship, and my ship is not an AA one. Let's try to bomb this Royal Sovereign, unfortunately we did not extraordinary damage, we can try to do that again. And kill her. Yes. We didn't even waste lots of aircraft. Now we might have a problem because of uh, the the speed increase is ended. Okay, if our two aircraft carriers manage to sink that Royal Sovereign, we might be able to get an advantage. But I don't literally know. The problem here is that we have an enterprise to face. Oh, these torpedoes were good. Yeah, there are some ships difficult to face. With our maneuverability we can do some good things, 
but unfortunately I'm gonna say that oh damn that enterprise is very very fast If we if we manage to dodge our planes and torpedoes, you know, we can do something, but I don't know. Really. She's gonna dodge, is she? No, she's not. One hit. Nice. We have to do that again. We have to kill this Enterprise right now. Yes. Okay, now mostly of our problem are done. Mostly, I'm saying. Because one of our CVs died and the Royal Sovereign is having the uh, the best on uh, our last teammate. And this ship itself is not capable of standing by its own I mean one versus all is not possible or if it is it is going to be very hard mm. I am running literally towards this Sangamon I have to destroy her mostly is that right 12 sec oh damn i literally missed i think one or maybe two bombs are not even gonna hit maybe actually three oh literally only one bomb did hit oh don't write me right now Now, oh dang, I missed the, the shot and our last teammate died. Damn. This Sangamon has to die. Is Royal Sovereign in range for us? Yes, she is. That ship has to die right now, please. One, two, she's not taking damage. Yeah, she is, but not as I thought. What? Oh, that was Royal Sovereign with the HE, I think. We're not gonna repair it until uh, she... Uh, until we are in cover, you know. I don't think we might be able to destroy both but maybe only one we set a floating on him and she is going down helpfully yes she is You know, we maybe can destroy this Royal Sovereign. I don't know, anyways. We have all squadrons uh, ready right now. The time has come. Yes. We are gonna do that, believe on me. 
if she doesn't bomb us, we are definitely gonna do that. Is this a Julia, right? Yes, she is. Nice. Oh, with a bit of lag. Look, Juyo is powerful. We had luck that mostly of the enemies were not strong. We had a lot of luck. Also, they didn't even hit lots with torpedoes. Uh, in the beginning you, uh, you could see that uh, this ship is not very good with torpedoes because of their low damage and everything. But anyways, this ship has good planes even though they are not, uh, not lots. In fact, we had 6 group maximum, I don't remember. But at the end we ended up with 3 groups and that's it, we made 5 kills anyways. Uh, we mostly use torpedo bombers, even though we launch 35 both. Uh, and uh, we hit 14 instead of 5. And mostly of the damage is by dive bombers. And that's it! Also, actually, uh, 521k and 106k did hit. And 505, this is not how math works. Anyways, good damage, and yeah, that's it, very nice. And this was everything for today's video, I hope you enjoyed, remember to subscribe and leave like, and I will see you on the next video, bye bye!